Mzodo wa bajetu wa mwaka ujawa kifedha unazidi kuibua hisi ya kali hasa kuhusiana na swala la kuongezwa kwa ushuru. Hata hivyo Wizara ya Fedha imetetea msoda huo na kuomba bunge liupitishe kama ulivyo. You want this money, but where will the money come from? That is a that is a difficult conversation Kenyans don't want to have. How how would we finance that budget? And I want to uh, request Kenyans that we should uh, finance our budget through revenues rather than through debt. Because debt is becoming a problem. Last week, I remember I paid six, we paid 60 billion on Monday. Yesterday we paid 40 billion in one with 100 billion. 100 billion can do so much. It is just time to slow. And I'm really beseeching new members, if you can to drive the finance bill to generate enough for to finance our budget, I think we will be we'll be doing very well. So we are hoping the finance bill that we have now will really be targeted by yourselves. Even for what we don't have, please propose new measures that in your in your view you think can help to fill the gap. Kulingana na katibu katika wizara hiyo ya fedha Chris Kipto, wenda mamlaka kukusanya ushuru nchini KRA ikakosa kufikia malengo yake ya ushuru na kufanya mikopo yongezeke. Yes, we have a gap uh, of about two, I think here it's talk about 270, but we are projecting that by end of June we may not collect 300 billion that we don't have enough revenues to finance our budget. And debt is the biggest problem. Sasa medokeza kuwa wa Kenya watarajie huduma gali kutoka kwa serikali katika mwaka wakifedha ujao. We have had meetings, uh, meetings with MDS to see if we can review the rates on existing services. Some were reviewed 20 years ago. We are trying to introduce on new emerging services or services currently not charged. We are trying to review policy on suspended charges. Nai Rice William Ruto anaona ushuru na ulipo na wakenya unaitajika kuongezwa. My drive is to push Kenya. Possibly this year we will be at 16% from 14%. I want in my term, God willing, to leave it at between 20 and 22%. percent Hawe naibuka huku utato kibuka kuhusu jinsi serikali ya Kenya, ilitua msada wa mamilioni ya shilingi kwa taifa la Palestine, na zaidi ya shilingi milioni tisini kuwalipa mawakili, walio saidia kulipa deni la Eurobond. The National Treasury not having legal team, why are we paying people for lawyers for negotiation of Europe, don't you have a legal team? This issue of Palestine, something on a Palestine, fresh appeal for Palestine territory, 132 million. Uh, what is it? Joel Chajaruninga, K24, Nairobi.